After the death of beloved actress Mary Tyler Moore, her husband, Dr. Robert Levine, has shared intimate details about their life together through a series of interviews and an HBO documentary titled Being Married to Mary Tyler Moore. The program offers a rare glimpse into the personal side of the famous actress, best known for her role in the eponymous 70s sitcom. Through home movies, photos, and heartfelt conversations, viewers can learn more about what made Mary Tyler Moore tick, both on and off the screen. Additionally, Mary Tyler Moore was born on December 29, 1936, in Brooklyn. She faced challenges in her early life, yet she rose to become a beloved actress and influential figure. During a difficult period in her life in the mid-1980s, she met Dr. Robert Levine, who became her partner and confidant. They married in 1983 in a private ceremony that reflected their deep bond. Their relationship was marked by mutual support, helping each other through tough times. This love lasted until her passing in 2017. In the late 1960s, the actress Mary Tyler Moore faced personal struggles when she lost her son Richard in a tragic accident involving a gunshot. During these challenging times, Dr. Levine provided immense support to her. This period also marked a professional turning point for Mary Tyler Moore, as she rose to prominence with notable roles in popular television shows. One of her most iconic roles came in The Dick Van Dyke Show, where she played Laura Petrie, Rob's wife, alongside Dick Van Dyke. Her portrayal earned her two Primetime Emmy Awards for Outstanding Lead Actress in a Comedy Series, establishing herself as a formidable talent in the industry. Following her success in The Dick Van Dyke Show, Mary Tyler Moore landed another groundbreaking role in The Mary Tyler Moore Show. As the lead character, Mary Richards, she navigated life as a single woman working in a newsroom in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Airing from 1970 to 1977, this beloved series garnered critical acclaim and broke barriers for women both on and off screen, earning a total of 29 Emmy Awards throughout its seven season run. Critics particularly lauded the program's exceptional writing and Mary Tyler Moore's brilliant comedic timing and acting prowess. Despite facing adversity in her personal life, Mary Tyler Moore persevered professionally and left an indelible mark on television history. To this day, fans continue to appreciate her contributions to the entertainment landscape and remember her for bringing joy and laughter into their homes. Renowned for her effervescent spirit and comedic timing, the actress Mary Tyler Moore also faced significant personal challenges throughout her life. One such challenge was her struggle with alcoholism, which affected both her career and personal relationships. Despite the success she experienced in Hollywood, including starring roles in popular television shows and films, she grappled with addiction behind the scenes. Eventually, she made the courageous decision to seek help and began the journey towards recovery. The loss of her son, Richard Meeker, in 1980 was another heartbreaking event that tested the actress's strength and resilience. Just two years after she had gotten sober, her only child died unexpectedly at the age of 24. This tragic turn of events understandably took a toll on her emotional well-being and could have derailed her progress in maintaining her sobriety. However, she persevered through this difficult time and continued to prioritize her health and healing. Through it all, the actress remained committed to growing and improving as a person, even in the face of adversity. Her ability to overcome these obstacles serves as a testament to her determination and inner fortitude. After hanging up her acting hat, Mary Tyler Moore dedicated herself to various personal interests and acts of charity. Her work in philanthropy was particularly notable in the field of diabetes research and treatment. This cause held great significance for the actress, as she had been diagnosed with type 1 diabetes at a young age. One individual who shares Moore's passion for this cause is Dr. Robert Levine, her third husband. Over the years, he has become one of her biggest supporters and advocates. In fact, Dr. Levine has openly shared his deep admiration and affection for the actress, often praising her strength and tenacity in facing life's challenges. Moore's commitment to diabetes awareness extended beyond just financial support. She also worked tirelessly to raise public awareness about the disease hoping to inspire others to get involved and make a difference. Through her efforts, she became a source of motivation and hope for countless individuals affected by diabetes. Dr. Levine himself has credited Moore with inspiring him both personally and professionally. He has spoken publicly about how her unwavering spirit and resilience have influenced his own work in medicine. Despite facing numerous health issues throughout her later years, Moore remained determined and positive, never losing sight of her goals. Throughout her post-Hollywood life, 
Mary Tyler Moore continued to touch lives and inspire change through her charitable endeavors and dedication to raising awareness about diabetes. And while her time in front of the camera may have come to an end, her impact on the entertainment industry and the wider community remains significant to this day. In the ever-evolving landscape of television, few have left a mark quite like Mary Tyler Moore. Born on December 29, 1936, in Brooklyn, New York, she would grow up to become one of the most cherished actresses in American entertainment. After minor roles in various TV shows and films, Moore's breakthrough came when she was cast alongside Dick Van Dyke in The Dick Van Dyke Show. Her portrayal of Laura Petrie brought her widespread acclaim and two Emmy Awards. However, it was her next iconic role that truly resonated with audiences and changed the course of television history. As Mary Richards in The Mary Tyler Moore Show, she challenged traditional gender norms by playing an independent woman pursuing a career in journalism, something unheard of during its time. With grace and humor, she tackled relevant social issues, paving the way for future generations of female leads. Throughout her illustrious career, spanning over five decades, Mary Tyler Moore amassed seven Emmys and a Tony Award nomination, solidifying her status as a true pioneer in the industry. Born on December 29, 1936, in Brooklyn Heights, New York, Mary Tyler Moore was the oldest child of George and Marjorie Hackett. Her father worked as a clerk at a pet supply store, while her mother stayed home to take care of Mary and her younger brother John. The family later moved to California when Moore was around eight years old. Moore's interest in performing arts began at a young age. She started taking dance lessons when she was just seven years old and continued to pursue it throughout her childhood. However, it wasn't until high school that she discovered her passion for acting. After appearing in several school plays, Moore decided to pursue a career in show business. One of the earliest influencers in Moore's career was her dance teacher, who encouraged her to explore her creativity and express herself through movement. Another significant influence was television executive Tinker Lindsay, who gave Moore her first big break by casting her in the popular sitcom The Dick Van Dyke Show. Playing the role of Laura Petrie, Moore quickly became a household name and won over audiences with her comedic timing and relatable personality. Throughout her career, Moore also drew inspiration from other successful actresses like Judy Garland and Lucille Ball. She admired their talent, work ethic, and ability to captivate audiences with their performances. Despite facing numerous challenges and setbacks along the way, these women served as constant reminders of what could be achieved through hard work and determination. As Moore's career progressed, she sought guidance from various mentors in the industry, including actor Robert Redford and director Martin Scorsese. Both men played instrumental roles in helping Moore refine her craft and expand her range as an actress. Their support and encouragement allowed her to tackle more complex and challenging roles, further solidifying her status as a respected and accomplished performer. Despite coming from humble beginnings, Mary Tyler Moore defied all odds and became one of the most beloved and influential actresses of her time. Through her unwavering dedication, talent, and resilience, she left an indelible mark on both the small and silver screens, inspiring countless others to follow in her footsteps. Today, her legacy continues to resonate with fans and aspiring actors alike, serving as a testament to the power of perseverance and self-belief. From a young age, Mary Tyler Moore showed a keen interest in performing. She was born on December 29, 1936, in Brooklyn, New York, and moved to California as a child. At the age of eight, she started taking dance lessons, which sparked her love for being on stage. However, it wasn't until high school that she discovered her true passion, acting. During her senior year, Mary landed the lead role in the school play, The Leading Lady. This experience had a profound impact on her and solidified her dream of becoming an actress. After graduation, she began pursuing acting opportunities, eventually landing small roles in television shows and commercials. One pivotal moment came in 1959 when Mary auditioned for the CBS sitcom, The Dick Van Dyke Show. Initially, she read for the part of the show's female lead, Laura Petrie, but didn't get the part because she appeared too young compared to Dick Van Dyke. Instead, she took on the recurring role of Van Dyke's character's receptionist, Sally Rogers, but fate had other plans. A few months later, Carl Reiner decided to recast the role of Laura Petrie due to scheduling conflicts with the original actress. He remembered Mary's impressive audition and gave her another chance. Accepting the role of Laura Petrie proved to be life-changing for Mary. Not only did she receive critical acclaim for her performance, 
winning two Emmy Awards during the series' run, but she also became a trailblazer for women in Hollywood by portraying a strong, independent woman who balanced both work and family life. Her success on The Dick Van Dyke Show opened doors to future projects, further cementing her place as one of America's most beloved actresses. Mary Tyler Moore's journey to stardom was marked by significant obstacles. Born on December 29, 1936, in Brooklyn, New York, she experienced financial struggles early in life. Her family moved frequently due to her father's job changes, making it challenging for them to maintain stability. Despite these hardships, Moore developed a strong work ethic and determination to succeed. As a young actress, Moore encountered industry skepticism about her talent and potential. She initially struggled to find acting roles, often facing rejection before securing small parts on television, shows like Richard Diamond, Private Detective. However, Moore refused to let setbacks discourage her. Instead, she honed her skills and continued auditioning for new opportunities. One major breakthrough came when Moore landed the role of Laura Petrie on CBS's hit series The Dick Van Dyke Show. Although she had previously appeared on TV, this part solidified her place in Hollywood and showcased her comedic abilities. Yet even then, Moore still confronted adversity. Some critics questioned whether she could carry the show without her male co-star. Undeterred, Moore proved her doubters wrong through her exceptional performance. In fact, she became one of the most popular actors on the program and earned three Emmy Awards for her portrayal of Laura Petrie. Afterward, Moore went on to star in her own successful sitcom, The Mary Tyler Moore Show, further establishing herself as a formidable force in entertainment. Throughout her career, Mary Tyler Moore demonstrated remarkable resilience and resourcefulness in overcoming various obstacles. By persisting despite numerous setbacks, she paved the way for future generations of female performers seeking equal recognition in the industry. Today, her legacy continues to inspire aspiring artists navigating their paths toward success. Mary Tyler Moore's breakthrough moments began with her role as Laura Petrie on The Dick Van Dyke Show in the early 1960s. This part showcased her comedic timing and versatility, earning her two Emmy Awards. Her ability to portray complex emotions authentically set her apart from other actresses of the time. Later, in 1970, she starred in her own self-titled series, The Mary Tyler Moore Show. This program broke new ground by featuring a never-married, successful woman in her 30s as its lead character, something rarely seen on television before then. Critics praised Moore for her nuanced performance, which resonated with many women who saw themselves reflected in her character. Moore continued to push boundaries throughout her career. She took on serious roles, including playing a type I diabetic patient in the film Ordinary People, a performance that earned her an Academy Award nomination. Through all these transformative moments, Mary Tyler Moore left an indelible mark on both TV and movie screens, inspiring generations of actors and viewers alike. Mary Tyler Moore was known for her ability to portray complex and relatable characters on screen. She once said, I don't want to stand still, I want to grow. This desire for growth fueled her artistic vision and approach to acting. Moore believed in thoroughly researching and understanding her characters often drawing upon her own life experiences to add depth and authenticity to her performances. For example, when preparing for her role as Laura Petrie on The Dick Van Dyke Show, she drew inspiration from her experience as a housewife and mother. Her unique approach to character development included focusing on small details and nuances rather than grand gestures. In an interview, she explained, The key to making television believable is to do everything as simply and naturally as possible. One notable aspect of Moore's acting style was her ability to convey emotion through subtle facial expressions and body language. Her signature bashful smile became synonymous with her on-screen persona, allowing audiences to connect deeply with her characters. Despite facing numerous challenges throughout her career, including being told she wasn't pretty enough to become a successful actress, Moore persevered. She credited her determination and resilience to her upbringing, stating, my parents raised me to believe I could accomplish anything if I worked hard enough. Throughout her career, Moore used her platform to advocate for various social issues, including animal rights and diabetes awareness. These values were also reflected in her artistry, as many of her characters embodied strong female roles that challenged societal norms and expectations. Mary Tyler Moore's legacy continues to inspire generations of actors today reminding us all of the power of dedication, vulnerability, and authenticity in storytelling. 
Mary Tyler Moore was a groundbreaking actress who left an indelible mark on the television industry. She first gained fame for her role as Laura Petrie on The Dick Van Dyke Show in the early 1960s. Her portrayal of a modern, working wife challenged traditional gender roles and helped pave the way for future female leads. But it was her eponymous show, The Mary Tyler Moore Show, that truly solidified her status as a trailblazer. As Mary Richards, a single woman pursuing a career in broadcast journalism, Moore shattered stereotypes and became a symbol of women's independence and empowerment. According to TV Guide, she played one of the most positive role models ever seen on television. Moore's impact went beyond just breaking barriers. She also revolutionized comedy technique through her subtle facial expressions and body language. As director James Burroughs noted, she didn't have to say anything, it was all in her eyes, her face, her reactions. This style of physical humor set a new standard for sitcom acting and has been widely imitated since. Furthermore, the Mary Tyler Moore show tackled controversial topics like feminism, premarital sex, and equal pay, pushing boundaries for what could be discussed on network television. Its honest depiction of adult life resonated with audiences, leading to critical acclaim and numerous awards. Those inspired by Moore include Tina Fey, Amy Poehler, and Julia Louis-Dreyfus, all successful comedians and actors in their own right. Fey once said, Mary Tyler Moore made me feel like I could run my own life, which was a revolutionary idea at the time. Indeed, Moore's legacy continues to influence contemporary media. From fictional tributes like Netflix's The Marvelous Mistress Maisel to real-world honors like Smithsonian's National Portrait Gallery displaying her iconic red hat and coat, Moore remains a timeless inspiration for generations to come. Mary Tyler Moore was known for her acting roles, but she also had a rich personal life filled with values and interests that informed her work. She was a strong advocate for animal rights and diabetes research. Moore herself had type 1 diabetes, which she was diagnosed with when she was just 33 years old. This experience led her to become the international chairman of the Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation. Moore's love for animals extended beyond just advocacy. She and her husband even founded Broadway Barks, an annual star-studded dog and cat adoption event in New York City. Through these efforts, Moore helped countless animals find loving homes. Despite her busy career and philanthropic endeavors, Moore always made time for her family and friends. She valued close relationships and often spoke about the importance of having a support system. In fact, many of her closest friends were fellow actors and actresses who she met throughout her career. Moore's personal values and interests were deeply intertwined with her professional life. Her commitment to raising awareness for important causes like diabetes research and animal welfare inspired many of her characters and storylines. Additionally, her dedication to building genuine connections with those around her translated onto the screen, making her performances all the more authentic and relatable. Overall, Mary Tyler Moore was not only an accomplished actress, but also a compassionate individual who used her platform to make a positive impact on the world. Let's dive into the world of Mary Tyler Moore, a true trailblazer in the acting industry. Moore started her career in the late 1950s, but it was her role as Laura Petrie on The Dick Van Dyke Show that truly catapulted her to stardom. Her portrayal of a modern, working mother challenged traditional gender roles and left an indelible mark on television. Moore continued to break barriers throughout her career, becoming one of the first female producers in Hollywood and earning numerous accolades for her work, including multiple Emmy Awards. She also used her platform to advocate for important causes, such as animal rights and diabetes awareness. Now, let's look to the future. For those looking to follow in Moore's footsteps, she once offered some valuable advice you can't just sit there and wait for people to give you that golden dream. You have to get out there and make it happen for yourself. In other words, hard work and determination are key. Additionally, don't be afraid to take risks and challenge conventional norms. Like Moore did, strive to bring fresh perspectives and ideas to the table. And always remember the importance of giving back and using your talents to make a positive impact on the world. So, whether you're an actor, producer, or advocate, take inspiration from Mary Tyler Moore's lasting legacy and continue to push boundaries in your own unique way. Indeed, Mary Tyler Moore was a true trailblazer in the entertainment industry. Her passion for acting began at a young age when she took dance lessons and performed in local theater productions. This early exposure to performing arts laid the groundwork for her successful career. Moore's breakout role came in the late 1960s when she starred as Laura Petrie on The Dick Van Dyke Show. 
She played a modern, working woman who challenged traditional gender roles, paving the way for future female leads. After the show ended, Moore continued to push boundaries by producing and starring in her own sitcom, The Mary Tyler Moore Show, which debuted in 1970. Throughout her career, Moore broke new ground by tackling controversial subjects like feminism, equal pay, and premarital sex, issues that were rarely discussed on television at the time. By addressing these topics, Moore helped shape public discourse around women's rights and empowerment. But Moore wasn't just an actress and producer. She also used her platform to advocate for various social causes. She was a passionate animal rights activist and worked tirelessly to raise awareness about diabetes research after being diagnosed with type I diabetes herself. Despite facing numerous challenges throughout her life, including struggles with alcoholism and the loss of her son, Moore never lost sight of her passions or her commitment to making a difference. Through hard work, determination, and a little bit of humor, she left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry and inspired generations of actors and activists alike. Mary Tyler Moore's legacy serves as a powerful reminder of the importance of creativity, perseverance, and taking bold risks. As we reflect on her incredible journey, let us remember that each one of us has the potential to make a lasting impact on the world around us. As we take time to remember the talented actress Mary Tyler Moore, it's hard not to reflect on her impressive body of work. From her early days on The Dick Van Dyke Show to her groundbreaking role in The Mary Tyler Moore Show, she broke barriers and paved the way for future generations of women in television. Moore's ability to portray complex emotions and situations made her a standout talent. She brought depth and nuance to every character she played, making them relatable and memorable to audiences. Her comedic timing was impeccable, and she had a knack for delivering lines that left viewers laughing for days. But Moore's contributions to the entertainment industry went far beyond just acting. She was also a trailblazer behind the scenes, producing some of the most beloved shows of all time. Through her production company, MTM Enterprises, she gave opportunities to countless writers, directors, and actors who might otherwise have gone unnoticed. Of course, Moore's impact can still be felt today. Her work continues to inspire new generations of performers and creators who strive to follow in her footsteps and create art that resonates with audiences. And while she may no longer be with us, her legacy lives on through the many people whose lives she touched. So let's hear your thoughts on Mary Tyler Moore's incredible career and lasting impact. What were some of your favorite roles or moments from her time in the spotlight? Share your memories with us in the comments below. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more content celebrating the creative spirits shaping energy.